Hello, YouTubers. I'm Mitch Harper. How are you doing today? I hope all you guys are feeling positive and great this morning. I want to give a special shout out to a brother YouTuber, and his name is Kevin Samuels. Uh, Kevin Samuels, I appreciate you as another black man who's inspiring, who shows us uh, simple tactics on doing things that's right as far as in where to be, who to be, what to do, and how do we gonna make it happen. And I appreciate you for that. Um, because a lot of people don't get the picture. You got the picture. I'm starting out new in this situation and I'm starting to see the picture. And sometimes it's difficult because you're gonna say to yourself, am I really worth it to, to let these people hear how I feel? Am I really worth it on my voice be to heard? And for you saying that, and your your uh, channel, it makes me feel that I am worth it, and I appreciate you for doing that for me. Um, this is why you you shouldn't let anybody deter you, or I know you're not gonna let anybody deter you on how you feel on how you got your riches. Yes, you're black, and black people do make it because you're an example of that by what you have and what you got going on for yourself and how you articulate yourself in the community. So thank you again. Um, this is to all other black people. We are the cream of the crop. We are worth it in every sense and fashion known. We are worth it. Ideas came from us. Things we've done has come from us. We built this country. We built a lot of this world. We were here first. We have to understand that. And um, I really appreciate that he not so sums it up. So you know, look to his channel, Kevin Samuels. He's um, a black man that's very advanced in the way he is, and that's only being truth. So thank you again for that. So now, what I'm trying to explain to us, black, uh, African, black, American, uh, you know, Israelite people, I want you to understand this thing. When we have different types of people that are missing in the USA, that are black children, black people starting to be missing all over the United States, there's a problem, there's something wrong. They're harvesting body parts, uh, you know what I'm saying, livers and all that other kind of stuff out of somebody's child. It could be your child, it could be my child if I have a child. It could be anybody else's child. And then on top of it, what sources tell me is that you have your own kind that's selling their own relatives for a buck. Come on, America, this is getting ridiculous. You know what I'm saying? That's why a lot of us are moving away from the United States. Fuck it. Let's get out of here, y'all. Pull together and get out of here because you can make it anywhere. We've seen how beautiful all the countries are. It may be poor. You know what I'm saying? But hey, at least we don't have to worry about stupid bullshit like that. And I'm so serious because a lot of people you don't even care. And it doesn't seem like nobody cares. Nobody's taking nothing serious. Nobody's standing for nothing. We're a race that has no general uh, uh, heritage monies. Um, we're, we're not people that have a whole bunch a lot. We're dependent on other people because of the way the society has made us. We made this country. <laughs> off of free labor and nobody's giving us a dollar for something to fucking drink. I mean, you know what I'm saying? It, it, it's, it's ridiculous. It's getting, redu it's getting re redundant and retarded right now. And you people is, don't really see how it's affecting all of us here because there's a lot of people that's not on this crazy mayhem shit killing other individuals for body parts and all this other stuff. What are they feeling? A mo feeding a mountain lion somewhere? What's going on? You know what I'm saying? You people got to take and wake up. Wake the hell up. Wake up. Wake up. Seriously, wake up. This is why I'm leery around people. I sense that I can't be really true to them because they're not true to me or true to what my cause is. They always want to have hatred and always want to harm us. For what? You know? It should show you that we're a peaceful race, 
through all this bullshit that we're going through, we still smile on your face. We still do things to help you out. We still give our last. We still go through all the missions for no apparent reason, putting our freedom online just to service you. I'm telling it like it is, or how we, all of us help you guys do everything, and all of the hate is on us. All of the dysfunctional shit is on us. All the experimentation is on us. All of the poisons that you're putting on us is on everybody, not just us. Uh, you know what I'm saying? From the water to, to chemtrails to everything. So, you know, you just want to kill us all, but you don't see that. You know what I'm saying? It's not just about color, believe it or not. It's about money and about power and about the snacks or whatever the creatures want. Uh, to take and kill babies, to kill small children, to take that from our families. This is her, her crazy. And then they wonder why that every time we're around, we have so much hatred in our heart and don't want to be talking to nobody, don't want to be bothered to nobody. I hate to tell you that some people flee off that negativity too. So we can't get, let them win either. And it's hard. It's really hard. You know what I'm saying? You people just going to keep doing what you're doing, sleeping to your face falling on the ground, and you disappear by yourself. Hey, that's okay. You know what I'm saying? If it's all right with you guys, it's all right with me. You know what I'm saying? My family members are missing. My friends are missing. People are missing across the United States. Like, it's okay. Like, it's all right. But they want to smile on my face like everything is all right. And they want to put that passive... Uh, uh, prejudiceness, passive aggressive prejudiceness, and and all this other kind of stuff in my face, like it's okay. When the spirit of God, the spirit of of enlightenment, tells you that there's something wrong with that, that you not to take it seriously. So I know that a lot of you ain't that stupid, or you either caught up in the drugs, or caught up into other kind of bullshit, just to sedate yourself because of the realities of in this fucking crazy shit. So hey. You know, I don't know what to tell you guys, but I know, for, for instance, I woke up, I did a lot of legal stuff that I'm supposed to do, and you guys know what I'm talking about. So, hey, I'm ready at all times. And it's not just me, I have several thousand people behind me, uh, and it's all walks of life, thank you. Uh, Whoever is doing this crazy shit with stealing kids and killing kids and killing children and killing black folks, missing black kids and all this other stuff. You bring us over here to put us through a whole bunch of stuff that's bullshit. You bring us over here to make your lives better. Free labor, slaving us like dogs, and molesting our children, molesting us as we work. Men, women, and all of that stuff. Like we have some sexual desires or something like that. Oh, they're so beautiful. They're black. But you, you have so much hatred for us too. Is you going to either love us or hate us? Now I know why I, I'm a people, a social person. A lot of people don't want to be messed up with anybody, and you got to pay them because there ain't nothing else that's going on. We don't have nothing. You take everything from us and show us hate. Shoot. So I understand what they say. You got to pay us. Pay me. Fuck that. You know what I'm saying? I want some cash too, you know? <laughs> no, like I said, you want us out of the U.S.? Shell up some money. I don't mind taking that. $100,000. I can live anywhere across this world. Wonderful for the rest of my days. Come on, bro. This is ridiculous. We're human beings. We're all human beings. We all bleed the same. On, let me just take that back because I would say just like it is. Some of us are not from here. Some of us is in trophy, uh, like, like among us that's not here, belong to us here. Or beast and, and meat products that you get in the supermarket. I think that's kind of sick and crazy. But you people who want to stay asleep and let this stuff keep on going on, don't have a unity in yourself, fighting up different kind of colorisms, light skin it, dark skin it, all that bullshit. Hey, let's just ride and finish our race out. Let them kill us. It's number one. We're not trying to work to have stuff. You want to worry about other people, what they have. Bitch, get out there and work yourself. Work hard to do what you got to do for whatever job that it is. Just, I don't understand. I don't understand, bro. And I'm sitting here all the time thinking in my head, I have an intelligent mind. I'm a good person. You know what I'm saying? But I'm not all goody-goody either. You know what I'm saying? 
I feel like I, sometimes the way they got us going is I go outside and fuck up a bitch I see. Just fuck them up. But that's not the way we're supposed to be. That's just not the way it's supposed to be. Something up on a higher end who wants to have control in their baby type ways is want to keep us fighting against each other for control. That's all it has to be, bro. For control. Guys, I'm getting exhausted, getting tired of explaining the same shit going on. Nobody's waking up, nobody's listening to me. Uh, I don't know what else to do. But um, if you guys like what I have to say or like me, period, uh, like and subscribe. And uh, check out the further links that I have below and purchase something to help the betterment of this station, this channel that I'm trying to build. And I appreciate it. Thank you.